Hey there YouTube, long time no see. Um, as you might have seen, I've been posting adventure map reviews lately, and the quality pretty much sucks. Um, yeah, I, I, while I was gone in Cuba, I did like 13 videos. I thought I'd post them like once a one a week, but they were just pretty much all bad, so I just put well, the, like the last one. And uh, I pretty much stopped playing Minecraft for a bit, and then I just had fun a bit the other day making this monster trap. So, I, first off, I built this one thing. Oh, sorry, it's just because uh, I'm lagging a bit. I'll put it back on short, sadly. Yeah, um, I, ma I, I took this one thing I built, 58 by 58, uh, including the walls, the outside walls. Um... And I like used MC Edit and multiplied it by a lot, yeah. And I was like, "Oh, it's gonna make this epic monster trap. It's gonna be really good." But no, it sucks because what actually happens is you have imagine twenty floors of fifty by fifty. You're still gonna get the same amount of monsters in your trap as if you did one floor because there's only a certain amount of monsters that can spawn in that one area you have to expand it it's freaking messed up wasted my time and i uh, i don't even have the right amount of blocks so that they die in one shot but it works pretty cool oh yeah and i'm supposed to um i want the item yeah oh, just hurt him like this pretty cool red sword system i like it i'll show you how i did it really quick I am not in my theater. It took me this surprisingly this is what took me the most time. This piston thing over here, it just didn't work. I just tried so many things until I found like this on the internet. But it didn't exactly work as I wanted it to. But eh. It'll do. Um well, after seeing how I, this didn't really work, I tried making another monster spawner machine, or whatever, how you call it, monster trap. Sorry for the low uh, distance. It's this big thing over here. I'll just show you what it's like, basically. I don't think there's going to be any monsters, because we weren't close to it. And I put ice on top, yeah. This is sad. Okay, so it's the basic 30 by 80. Oh my god, it's freaking render already. One. It's too far. Okay. No, I, this is just too bad. Yeah. So we got our 30 by 80 over here. Jesus. Every time I film... Makes my computer lag. So, basically this, and then I think I mm, multiplied it by ten. So there's ten of these. Logically, it should be good, but I think monsters don't spawn unless you go near. You've been there, like not when you've been there, but you're the, um, that you were near there. That makes no sense, sorry. I'll just like get them to spawn. And the spiders. Um I was thinking of making something for the spiders, but I'm just too lazy. Because the spiders they just get stuck in the pipe. Um, and while I got bored, I made this pretty cool machines over here using dispensers and monster eggs. Like, I tried doing stuff with slimes and weird stuff. Here's my, um, basic, my little machine. Basically, I make monsters spawn over here. And they get dragged in. They go up. <laughs> I don't know. I wanted them to, I don't know what I was doing, I just wanted them to like, die of falling damage, and then I could get the items. But, it didn't work out how I wanted it to. 
So I ended up doing it with the lava at the end. Yeah. Let's get up over here. I'll start the machine. There. Now. This gets pretty laggy once all the items hit the ground. Oh yeah, zombie pigment. So let's go to the top. Oh, that went a bit too high. It should be reaching over here anytime soon. There you go. Oops. Then they end up over here. And they get hurt, basically. My item collection is. I'll just delete all of this stuff. While they die. Why is that zombie flesh? Alright, zombie pigment makes sense. I think the items changed not too long ago. I thought it was like beef or something, no it's gold pieces. Okay, so I finally got rid of the lag. Um, what happened is all the monsters ended up stuck in the pipe there. And they weren't dying because they were all like stuck together. Even though I picked up all the items, the lag didn't stop. So I changed it to peaceful and now it's all good. Sorry, I don't know what I'm doing. So, on to my next machine. It's this thing right over here. It's ba I have a door just to, so you can see. Basically, I just wanted to <laughs> I did this machine because I wasn't sure if arrows that went through a lava still worked. Because I kind of recalled seeing that not worked. Like, I tried it once and it just didn't work. But I did this machine just for fun and it turns out it works. Like, did I put... Yeah, yeah. Skeletons already. Let's go. Don't lag this time, please. Oh, wait. Shit. Should I just back up? Let's go check the arrows. So as you can see, this little area is getting pretty full of skeletons. And we have my arrow dispensers over here that are just like... <sighs> raping them. So yeah, this um, big machine is pretty cool. Could be dumb as well. Hey, go. Oh. Oh. It makes everything lag. I have some real pain. Um, my monster spawner over here. I don't know why it doesn't work as much as I want would have wanted it to do to work. I didn't make any system to pick up the items. Uh, if you guys have any, uh, actually, uh, if you guys have any project you want me to do, please write it in the comments. I'll do my best, because I'm, um, kind of out of ideas. I, f I, c I could do more mod reviews, but kind of lazy. I'd, I'd like a project, something fun, something where I could get better. And just adventure maps? Nah. They, those don't get many views. So, uh, as always, see you next time.